welcome back to my YouTube channel. Um, bless you. Harley is here with me today. We are doing my first ever PR unboxing. Um, sweetheart. Ma'am. This is not, this is not about you. No. I have gotten PR before as a micro influencer, content creator, whatever you want to call it. I call it just sharing my life and being creative and having fun with it. But, um... I've never gotten like this, these many packages all at once. And it's not all PR, some of the stuff I purchased um, myself and, and I'll let you guys know what pieces those were. And some of them were new brands that were brought to my attention. Um, so with further ado, let's get into everything. Um, if anything, I want this video to be an encouragement to those who think that they can't be a content creator or can't work with brands. Um, because you have a small following or anything like that. I've worked with large name brands and I feel like I'm a nobody. So keep going after your dreams and as long as you believe in yourself, you got it girlfriend, okay? Was that cheesy? Did I just give my first ever cheesy like pep talk? Either way, it's true and I hope you listen to it. Okay, so first up, I have zero self-control and absolutely no patience. So I've already opened up some of these packages. Full disclosure, I tried to hold out till today to um, open everything on camera. But again, zero self-control. So hi, welcome. Nice to meet you. I'm Melissa and I have no patience. Um, this package is pretty exciting because I've gotten to know not only the brand, but the CEO and owner behind this brand. And I think she is the next Sarah Blakely. I think she's absolutely inspiring and creative. Why are you licking the box? Um, and she's truly changing what we as women know bras to be. So in this box, I have the wherewithal bras. There are two different kinds. There's a strapless, which I believe is this one. No, this is the um, um, everyday t-shirt bra. And as you can see, totally different than what we're used to. They have these new backs to them, which equate to three, up, I think it's up to three different bra sizes. I'm going to do an entirely separate video dedicated to these bras, their sizing, the story behind them, um, how the CEO, Danielle, came to start this company and this bra design. This is the strapless. It is amazing. Um, very supportive. I speak for the ladies of... Um, the BTC, if you don't know what the BTC is, it's the, you know, I don't know if I can say that on YouTube without like being shadow banned or something, but, um, has, she has the two different bras right now and then some underwear line. And what I love about her underwear is she places the seams in the back. So you're not getting any added chunky fabric to your hips or anything like that it's honestly she's a genius um and she's truly thinking of every woman in mind so i will do a much longer video on all of that at a later date okay now let's continue with some more pr oh my god okay first up a new brand called Jukebox, um, American female owned brand. I also already opened this one. These are the cutest flipping things. They're not, it's not hand soap, it's body soap. So like you'd replace, if you use body wash, you'd replace your body wash with these hand soaps. They sent me four of their fragrances and their little um, soap stage. They all smell flipping amazing. I can't get over it. So we have coffee house vanilla and then you take the soap stage and stick it to the back of the soap bar. And so that way you're not like your soap isn't slipping out of your hands every two seconds in the shower. Um, so I thought that was absolute genius. It's um, cruelty free, sustainably sourced, no harsh chemicals and made from natural oil. So it's so good for your skin. That's why they say, I, like it's all over the website, like use it on your body, don't use it on your hands. This is the lavender field. This is the Lavender Fields Body Soap. They all smell so flipping good. Island in the Sun is my absolute favorite. It truly, like you sniff this and you're on the island drinking a pina colada. It's flipping amazing. I just, it is so just like picture you smelling like the islands, but like in an elegant, sexy way, you know? Like she just has that 
sun-kissed bronze and that ocean sprayed wavy hair and is just strutting her stuff doing the damn thing you know that's how that fragrance makes me feel um and then you have pink champagne which is also absolutely adorable and on their website they show you how the soaps are made so it's pretty much like they make the big blocks and then um, just cut them so like you can tell like this one I don't want to open all the way because it has pink Himalayan salt on it and it's like kind of coming apart because it's been tossed around in the box um, but it's actually I'm, I am going to pull it out I just don't want because Harley's with me you know do it over that box it's not food but like see how cute that is Oh my god, I just noticed on the sides of the boxes, they have, smells like it sounds, so bubbly, uh, pink champagne is lush and lively with a bubbly B-side, pink grapefruit, cedarwood, and peach, coffeehouse vanilla is soft and soulful with an earthy backbeat, vanilla bean, lang lang, amber, and it has a light scrub, so pink champagne has no scrub, Van coffee house vanilla has a light scrub so like exfoliating materials um i believe i was reading online that the exfoliating materials in the vanilla coffee house are actually vanilla bean which is so amazing um and then the island in the sun is fruity and floral with a bamboo baseline jasmine citrus and coconut and it also has a light scrub um i can't remember what the light scrub comes from Oh, bamboo powder is the scrub in that one. And then the lavender fields forever is lavender pear and driftwood with no scrub. And I believe they gave me a discount code. I can't remember off the top of my head, but if they did, I'll just link it down below for you guys. I think these are like absolutely adorable. The whole premise behind it is um, jukebox, you know, you sing in the shower, that type of ordeal. And so each soap is their own little record. And I just think they just did such a really good job with the marketing and the material itself and the item. And I'm a big fan of supporting not only female owned brands, but new brands, smaller brands, um, things like that so definitely check them out especially if you know someone who's maybe going to college uh, moving into a dorm moving into a new house um bridal shower gift it would be really cute like to throw in like a housewarming basket or something like that put it in your guest bathroom it is it they're just like flipping adorable i can't and the soap stage is perfect i don't know if you guys can see because of the way the camera's angled but this dog has just had her head on my lap it is Harley's world and we all just live in it. Um, if you follow me on Instagram, you're very well aware of this. Next box is Good Molecules. I can't lie to y'all. Again, going back to uh, the premise that I have zero patience. Um, you guys know I love skincare. So two of these products I've already been consistently using. One of which I've already used already today. And it is, these these two boxes are empty. The Discoloration Correcting Serum. They're actually in my bathroom. Um, I've talked about them before on my Instagram. I absolutely love this serum. As you see, box is empty because it's currently sitting on my bathroom counter. And I've been using this alongside the yeah i'm you're just gonna have to bear with me the niacinamide niacinamide brightening toner these two together game changer such a big game changer um for all skin types it is brightening again can't get the box open but as you can see box is empty um for all skin types brightening and then the other one is for hyperpigmentation and dark spots and also for all skin types the other two products they sent me that i haven't gotten around to using i tried the one um for a makeup look but it was i only got to wear it for like a couple hours so i want to do a true wear test with this product and it's the silicone free priming moisturizer um and it says this formula is free from silicones, mineral oils, fragrances, alcohols, and PEGs, which is so good for your skin, especially if you do a full face of makeup like I do. Um, your pores already go through enough, so the less you can make them go through, the better. So I'm very excited to try that. And then this one's really intriguing to me. So this is a good molecule. The overnight exfoliating treatment. So it says directions, apply a few drops to clean skin at night and fully absorb before applying other serums 
Use up to three times per week may cause irritation if used with retinol and other acids. It says promote brighter, fresher skin with a balanced blend of glyocic, glyoc, glyoc. Am I having a stroke? Glycolic, lastic, and salicylic acids. I am not okay. So I do exfoliate my skin, but I've never done an exfoliating treatment overnight that's like the only thing that's like very intriguing to me so i will report back i haven't even opened this taken this one out of the box the other one i have i guess i should probably do that i'm like not y'all this is my first box unboxing okay like just bear with me um oh it looks like um what are those you guys know what i'm talking about that other brand um <laughs> Why do brands want to work with me? I'm so bad at this. Um, it just, it looks like just like a serum. Okay, we're going to have to try this this weekend. Apply a few drops to clean skin at night and fully absorb before applying other serums. Use up to three times per week. May cause irritation if used with retinol and other acids. I mean, that's normal. That's to be expected. It says it has SPF in it. Interesting. This next one very excited about I actually think so there's supposed to be two products in here and now that I'm getting to this um, I think one of the products is in the other room because I've already tried <laughs> one of these on but if you haven't heard of this brand all over Instagram all over TikTok, it's TA3 um, they are the waist shaping swimwear so basically it like it's a one piece and it comes with the lace back they have dresses now I think they might have like everyday bodysuits um, but it tightens in the back and like cinches your waist so they sent me this gorgeous bright pink one which of course isn't is it in here this is the bag it came in it's in the other room but you guys will see it um, on my TikTok if you don't follow me I'll definitely be posting TikTok reels um, and then I'll eventually do a swimwear try on haul with this brand so you guys will see and then they sent me the black one and it's a strappy oh my god wait I love this I haven't taken this out of the bag yet and so the straps are adjustable but this is what the back looks like I don't know if you'll be able to tell but it has the strings to pull in your waist it is basically shapewear meets swimwear like honestly genius like we have so many creative people in this world it's insane absolutely insane so very excited to do a try on haul with that with you guys i finally got my hands on a denim mini skirt i'm so excited to style this you guys have absolutely no freaking clue um it is from the brand stradivarius i don't know I'll put it down below though. Um, very, very excited. And then I saw these cute little heels and I really love black strappy heels. I feel like they're just like a basic that you need to have in your closet. And I have a pair, but they flipping kill my feet. So I saw these and was like, mm, we're going to try these out. I feel like you guys can't see her right now, but I just need you guys to understand like what is going on right next to me this is this is just harley's world and we are all living in it right my angel baby okay it's another thing for jamaica from amazon we are entering our coastal cowgirl era and i couldn't be a coastal cowgirl without a coastal cowgirl hat so I'm not going to lie, I can't really tell what it looks like um, from my little viewfinder, but what do you think? I can't tell if this is cute or not. Can you guys let me know? I'm leaning towards no, um, but what do you guys think? So this one wasn't PR, this was a direct purchase. Um, and the one item in here my girlfriend already has and i just love it and she loves it so i purchased one for myself she has it in purple and i bought it in a brown color which now that i'm looking at this i feel like i bought the much bigger version than she has um i should have probably asked her what size she has because this this baby's huge um 
Okay, like I probably won't need to pack a makeup bag if I'm packing this because this guy's ginormous. So this is a cow pack package. And this is clear cosmetic case. It's the large one though. I know I grabbed the large one. Um, and I got it in the like beige tan color. So it opens up like this. And then you have, oh, it has like a little pocket right here. Cute. And then it's just basically clear and you can put full size items on each side. I have so many trips planned um, for this year that this will come in such good handiness. Um, and I just thought it was so perfect and it has the two little handles up there. So it doesn't have anywhere to like, if you're traveling to put it on the back of a suitcase, but honestly, if you're putting full size items in this you're probably putting this in your suitcase and checking it anyway so um loved 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 this next thing hopefully before my camera up and quits on me i got the cow pack tote bag now i know everyone has the bays but i have a 16 inch oh my god 16 inch oh my god um mac laptop and my one girlfriend the same one who has the cow pack she has the smaller base um tote bag and i tried putting my laptop in it and it like it, it wasn't going and i know there's the bigger one but i didn't really want the bigger one but now i'm also contemplating because after looking at it online apparently these are like the same size um I might order the base one and do like a review for you guys comparing the two. Let me know if that's something you'd want to see. It comes with the laptop case. Oh my god, I love this. <gasps> this is so good. I am so excited. Kind of take back what I said. Now I kind of want the strap is in here. Um, I'll do a full unboxing video of this on tiktok for you guys because this is just like the material is so nice like i'm i'm honestly more obsessed with this than i thought i was going to be and my laptop will 100 percent fit in here this is flipping beautiful i love this oh my god i also love the color they have a bunch of different colors um i think they have some colorful ones like purple green maybe but then they have your traditional like browns tans um blacks whites it's just so beautiful and then it has this so like when i do go to jamaica next weekend this will just sit right on top of my like she's just so beautiful i'm like taken back i'm so happy i bought this wow good job Alyssa. the next last but not least package is from paravel if you don't know paravel i should probably stop banging on it um if you don't know paravel one of my good girlfriends works for them introduced me to the brand they are a luggage company, um, but the thing that stood out to them about me is they used recycled materials. I think on their website it says that they've um, used over 5.5 million recycled plastic water bottles in their products. So, and I um, wanted to film an aesthetically pleasing unboxing. I don't know if it'll come out aesthetically pleasing, but um, you guys will catch a snippet of me filming it. But this is the check luggage it is so stunning and i know some of you probably think i'm crazy i kind of thought it was crazy i went with this cream and tan they have this really gorgeous all black color so the the plastic's all black and then the leather's black and it is chef's kiss i honestly probably should have gotten that but this was just so pretty to me so i will be getting a protective cover off of amazon um i'll link the one that i purchased down below it does have a tsa lock so nothing's going to get ruined um and it's just so beautiful and so luxe and you feel good about having it because you know you're purchasing from a sustainable brand and and we love sustainable brands um this little guy does not get jammed at all also has like a soft close which i kind of like like it's just that <laughs> makes me feel fancy you know um but she is stunning full disclosure i have no idea how to set the lock on this yet so i'm gonna have to do some research and knowing me i'm gonna lock myself out of my own suitcase so 
love that um but yeah this is i just i'm so happy with this purchase i'm also getting the um carry on should be coming in the mail soon um but this is the one that made it in time for the video and i actually just got a notification that another package just showed up at my door so ryan's gonna kill me he is, he is. Um, thank you so much for watching this YouTube video. If you guys want to see a closer look on some of these products, make sure you're following me on Instagram and TikTok. I'm going to be doing a deeper dive. Um, stay tuned for the Wherewithal Bra Review video because there'll be some really good educational content in there. And especially if you, um, honestly, it doesn't matter what size your boobs are. Watch the video because the bras are really great. And the CEO and creator of the Wherewithal Bra is truly just like an inspirational being. So I'm so happy to be a partner with Wherewithal. So stay tuned for those videos. I love you guys. Make sure you like and subscribe. It means the world to me. Let me know what you guys want to see. Like, tell me. I love creating content for you guys. So just speak up. Love you guys. Love this community. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye.